Yeah. Hey, I just wanted to celebrate something like end of a school year, or if you're that kind of person, beginning of school year, and you, and what do you celebrate with? Well, you get like ice cream or something. What ice cream do you get? Well, we already did Cake Mountain Dew Cake Smash. You can go check that video right up here. We decided with their game fuel line to do sherbet, which I don't. Is it technically ice cream? I, I don't know, but. Mountain Dew Celebration Sherbet is here, so we're gonna go and review it. So, yeah. Uh, I heard, saw this, and it, with Game Fuel, I always thought it was to be done. It was getting replaced with Mountain Dew Rise. Uh, apparently not, as it's still there, but now it's only off their a store exclusive that you can only buy through certain storefronts. Though I have seen Game Fuel like certain Walmarts, but I feel like it's only until their supply runs out. I don't, I really don't know how that's all working, but yeah. Let's go ahead and try this. Let's let the courage take us over, as uh, tagline is. So I really like this can though. We're gonna take a look at the can. We got some nice uh, blue and dark blue and orangish camo uh with some a lion logo it's up with the um game fuel e-gamer logo team i don't know but i really like this can courageous that's the thumbnail courageous in big letters i really like it. and then this nice soft blue on half of it as with a lot of Mountain Dew reviews I like to do, I always cover the Zero Sugar variant with it as well as the rolling slight differences. Unless I reviewed one later, like the Frostbite, and then the Zero Sugar version came out like a year later, if I can find it. But this is the Zero Sugar version, and like a lot of Zero Sugar, they change it the can, make it look different. I like I like this can better than I do like that one. That one I really like. This one, like I like a little more. Uh, they swapped out the dark blue. Uh, just the blues for white and silver with the orange. I think it looks really cool. Neat contrast with the light blue. I think it works a lot better. But let's go ahead and try it, shall we? And hope this does not explode on me. As a lot of sodas have done in the past. Huh. <laughs> It did. Well, that's only because, thanks to uh, my friend Doofadag95 for mailing this to me as uh, I couldn't get the regular version. So thanks, man. Uh, please go check his channel. A uh, thing will be coming up here. Please go check it out. He deserves a lot of love. Uh, he makes great round dude content. If you want more, if you want another opinion on great round dude products, go check him out. He really deserves credit, but... And hopefully, if you were planning on collabing to make this video, but hopefully, by the time we're able to do something, man, and hopefully you see this. So, let's go ahead and try this. Let's show off the color. I've got my cup. Alright, so we've got a very light orange in color, very um, different contrast to live wire that's more of a popsicle orange. I wonder how much it's going to taste like live wire. Tastes like, um, it 
Yeah, it tastes like orange dreamsicle. Adds like as I said before, the Lyra has is more of an orange popsicle, very basic crushed orange soda. Um, this is slightly different as it's got more of the orange dreamsicle flavor to it. I really like. Yeah, let's see how it compares to the zero. Oh, they only put the zero sure. Oh, they only put the zero on it. That's interesting. Let's hope this doesn't explode on me either. Why did that one not explode on me? But the other one did. I mean, maybe because I, I don't know. Just came out of the mail. I, I have zero clue. Let's see how much of a color difference there is. Eh, there's not much. It, maybe it's just me that there is no color variation, but I always feel like there's a different color to it. Zero one, it somehow tastes more like live wire. I don't really like that. It tastes more like live wire. Yeah, I don't like that zero one. It's very. It's just very live wire. Like, it's disappointing. And I get that um, with some flavors, they're going to have a weird overlap where they taste very similar. Um, like the Berry Monsoon and the, I think it's the Dark Berry that you can only get like an Applebee's. But those are, those are very uh, similarly flavored. Excuse me. Um, yeah, I just... I don't know, it's just lackluster to me, I guess. It's, I don't know. I like the red one better. Uh, I don't know how much it compares to the orange game fuel. I haven't tried that one. I don't think I've ever found that one. Uh, but, I don't know. We'll see whenever I make that game fuel video. But, yeah, I, I think I like it. It's an interesting flavor, an interesting one to come out around when cake smashes me. Um, consider like, comment, subscribe on the video. Um, any comments help, any likes help. It gives me more into the algorithm. And just subscribing, you can update some more content and much other stuff. So please consider checking out all my socials at Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram at a variant of Nate and my website. Uh, this is the Podcast Network. Links are all down in the description. I'll link down to the Mundu Gameville story. You're still the case of this. And you also check out Dupinac95. Uh, his link will be down there as well. So, check it out. Excuse me, check that all out, and I'll see you later. Yeah.